Dad, I'm gay. Like, always have been, have known since forever. A very personal moment that's touching people all over the world today. A young U.S. military serviceman serving overseas calls home to tell his dad that he's gay on the very same day, Don't Ask, Don't Tell ends, and he shared the experience with the world on YouTube. And if you think that's emotional, just wait until you see how his dad responds. Welcome back to Showbiz Tonight. I'm A.J. Hammer in New York. So in just over 24 hours, that YouTube clip it has racked up more than a million views. 21-year-old Air Force Airman Randy Phillips, who's based in Germany, had a camera rolling as he made that emotional call just moments after the military's don't ask, don't tell policy officially ended, allowing gays, of course, to serve openly. Well, Randy used the occasion to finally tell his father back home in Alabama that he's gay. It is a super tense moment that turns into a super emotional one. Watch this. Can I tell you something? Yeah. Will you love me, period? Yeah. Like, you'll, you'll always love me, as long as I'm a... Dad, I'm gay. Okay. Like, always have been, I've known since forever. And, uh, I know I haven't seen him in like a year, and, uh, I, I don't know when's the next time I'll be able to see him. I, I didn't want to do it over the phone. I wanted to tell you in person, but, uh, I, I mean, I didn't want you to find out any other way. You still love me? I still love you, son. Yes, I still love you. Are you okay, Ed? Okay, I don't like you, Chef. I still love you. Okay? Yeah. I always will, no matter what. Alright? Yes, sir. You love my son. I'm very proud of you. Okay? Yes, sir. Well, I love you. All right, I love you. Love you too, All right, bye. Oh, my Lord. TV and radio host Michael Billy joining me now in New York. I mean, it's unbelievable, Michael. You can see the tension in his face. You can almost feel it through the computer screen and the TV screen. And then the same with the relief that comes at the end. What goes through your mind when you see this video? I'm not ashamed to admit I really cried this morning when I saw it. You know what? It honestly reminded me of when I came out to my own father, my own parents in Teaneck, New Jersey, years and years ago. Uh, and how honest and liberating it is. People need to understand that when you're hiding that about yourself and your life, it can build up so much emotion thinking that your parents are gonna leave you forever. And in just a few words, somebody lets you know it doesn't matter. My father said, hey, you're my son no matter what, and I love you. A Changed and, my life. And now you go around the country trying to help kids and students learn how to come out and, and tell them your story. Do you think this video can actually be a, a teaching tool to that end? What can people learn from watching this? Oh, absolutely. I mean, YouTube has been an amazing tool when it comes to gay advocacy coming out and people understanding what students are really going through and what uh, adults are going through, even servicemen are going through. It's, you said a million and plus, you know, that's a million plus people that understand the emotion and how heavy it is to be honest and authentic about your life to your loved ones. Yeah, because again, keep in mind, this isn't something that was just a phone call that he was taping and, and putting on, yeah. on, on YouTube hoping that maybe a few people would see it. Now it's out there for everyone and the entire world. So he really, I think in his mind, he felt like he was taking a risk and he mm -hmm. see that it, saw that in the end, he really wasn't. Yeah, I think the message is to so many other gay, lesbian, GLBTQ people out there is that sometimes we really have to trust our loved ones and the people in our life uh, to have a good reaction, to keep us in their life. They're, that fear often is our own. I, I encourage people also to just go online and find that video to watch the entire seven and Absolutely. a half minutes because you really get a sense of the tension. Michael Billy, thank you so much. I appreciate it.